Now, South Africa's anti-apartheid icon, Nobel Peace Prize winner Archbishop Desmond Tutu celebrated his 90th birthday with a low-key church service at Cape Town's St. George Cathedral. Tutu is often hailed as South Africa's moral conscience and the great reconciler of a nation that was divided by decades of racist politics. Now, although frail, Desmond Tutu attended the service at St. George's Cathedral in central Cape Town, where the country's first black Anglican Archbishop, he had delivered sermons excoriating apartheid. In 1984, Tutu had won the Nobel Peace Prize for his non-violent opposition to apartheid, and a decade later, he witnessed the end of that regime. After retiring as Archbishop in 1996, Tutu became the chairman of South Africa's Truth and Reconciliation Commission, which investigated into the human rights abuses during the apartheid era. Desmond Tutu also chaired the Truth and Reconciliation Commission set up to unearth the atrocities that were committed during the dark days of apartheid. After South Africa achieved democracy in 1994, he continued to be an outspoken proponent of reconciliation, justice and LGBT rights. Happy birthday, Daddy. It's so wonderful that we're celebrating 90 gorgeous years with you, and I wish you 90 more. It's impossible to think of that history without seeing Desmond Tutu as the embodiment of it all. He really presents that part of our history in a way that very few other people can do. And, and, and to be here today on his 90th birthday, I mean there were times, let's be honest, when we thought the health challenges were such that he would never make it. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.